Welcome back to this week's Health Through Literacy through Michigan Fitness Foundation's Health Through Literacy. And today we are going to be reading a book called We Like to Move by Elise April with Regina Sarah Ryan and illustrations by Diane Iverson. But of course, before we begin, I have a couple of questions for you. So my first question is, what do you think this book is going to be about? And remember, you can just shout it out at home, okay? What do you guys think this book is going to be about just by looking at the pictures? Okay, so maybe it's going to be about kids. Okay, what else do you think it's going to be about? Moving, yeah, all right. So who do you guys exercise with? It looks like on this, this book cover that all of these friends are exercising together. So who do you like to exercise with? Your friends, cool. Who else? Oh, your sister and your brother. Oh, that's so nice. Your cousins, your mom and dad, aunt, uncle, grandparent. Wow, that is great to have friends and family to exercise with. Now, where do you guys exercise? Where do you guys exercise? Okay, when you go to the park, where else? At school, okay. Where else do you exercise? When you go on walks with your family outside? Oh, that's great. Mm, now, when do you guys exercise or move around during the school day? Do you guys have breaks during the school day? Okay, so maybe when you step up to, to stretch. Maybe when you play outside, kind of like a recess. Awesome. Okay, so this question you might have to think about for just a second. Why do you think it's good and important to move around and to get some exercise? Why do you think? It helps us to sleep better, yeah. Yeah, good. It helps us to stay healthy. Awesome. Good job. Why else do you think exercise is important for us? It's fun. Yes. Why else? Yeah, it helps us to be strong. Helps our heartbeat. Those are great benefits of exercising. All right. Two more questions for you. How do you like to move? What do you guys do to get up and move in? Okay, you play tag. What else do you do? Okay, you do stretches with your sister. That's fun. What else? Okay, when you walk the dog. Yeah, yeah, awesome. There are lots of different ways we can move and so many fun ways to exercise. And the last question is how long do you think you should be trying to exercise for each day? And shout out an answer or a guess. Seven hours? <laughs> that would be a long time exercising. That was a good guess though. Any other guesses? 10 minutes? Okay, so we should exercise a little bit more than that. Do I have any more guesses? Okay, good, yes. We should be trying to exercise for one hour each day. So you kids should be trying to exercise about one hour each day to kind of get those wiggles out, to get your energy out, to make your muscles strong and get your heart beating. All right, well, let's see if this book shares with us some different ways we can get moving and exercising. Oh, I almost forgot your challenge during the book. So if there is an exercise that we read about in the book, I want you to jump up and try and do that exercise really quickly before we move on to the next exercise. So if it says to jump, I want you to stand up and I want you guys to jump. If it says to run, I want you guys to stand up and run in place. Okay, can you do that? Okay, let's begin. We like to hop. We like to swim. 
We like to climb. We like to spin. We like to kick. We like to bowl. We like to jump. And we like to roll. We like to dance. We like to run. We like riding bikes. It's healthy and fun. We like to move from birth to old age. We like to move right off the page. The end. That was a good book, wasn't it? Okay, so before I let you go, I have just a few more questions for you. So my first question for you is while we were reading the book, did you see an exercise that was new to you or that you've never tried before? What was it? Riding a bike. Okay, this is a good time to start learning how to ride a bike. Good. Anything else? Bowling, yeah. The cool thing is you can bowl at home with some empty containers and a softball or a toy. You can try and roll that on the ground and try and hit those empty containers like empty cereal boxes down. It's pretty fun. Okay, one more question for you. What can you do at recess or outside of recess at home to be active today? What do you guys think you can do? Yeah, you could totally run around, good. What else could you do? Oh, you could do some stretches. Yeah, what else could you do to get up and move in and running around? Jumping jacks, wow. Any other ideas? Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that book and I will see you guys next time, bye. Your healthy snack challenge for today is to find a healthy snack to give you back your energy after you spent a lot of it exercising and moving around. Today I made a healthy trail mix by mixing together dried cranberries, some whole wheat cereal, and some peanuts. 